Third slip. Yeah, this innings of Afghanistan is afloat. Oh, this is. Yeah, that won't please the bowler at all. That's him sharp. He'll want his fielders right in the game here. This is the early part of the innings. Everyone should be G'd up. But at the moment, it's Afghanistan. They look up for it. After every good stroke, the batters are getting themselves together, having a chat. And what these two parties have done differently in this innings, they haven't been committing on the front foot. They're just sighting the ball, making the decision at the last moment. And that's why they've been able to pull the ball well and work the ball into the gaps. That's good batting. Good Buzz has had most of the strike. He's faced 25 deliveries. His partner's only faced eight. Jonathan Trottix, England International. Westfield. Westfield. It's been scrappy from Pakistan this afternoon. Dropped off. Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a difficult position to field as a fielder reading at point or back foot point you have to anticipate everything coming to you and he's been efficient Imam al at that position a rare mess from him and with that double Afghanistan have now posted their highest opening stand versus Pakistan in one day internationals the sixth one day international between the two countries Afghanistan haven't managed to post a win yet been a couple of close ones Overact might be a little tidy as well and a short extra cover that's for the one that just holds in the pitch There's fumbling and bumbling going on here. But I'm enjoying his batting. He's moving so well. So well, Gurbaz. He's looking to get to the pitch of the ball. When the ball is not pitched up, it's been very efficient off the back foot. Quite enjoyable so far. Those 27 deliveries, the ball to Gurbaz. Uh, he's not happy about something and so Nassim Shah will have to start again that will irritate the fast bowler but you have to take your hats off to, to Afghanistan after what happened a couple of days ago there would have been a few scars there no doubt there would have been plenty of grumblings we know the messages that can be conveyed, conveyed on social media nowadays that the team can come in for an awful pasting so the management would have got together with the players and they've managed to put that behind them very very well indeed Now there is a huge difference in playing for the gallery and playing for the team and that must have been emphasized when those uh, team meetings happened before this game and these two players have taken the responsibility and that's a good news for Afghanistan making better use of their talent these two batters Oh, another no ball. And so another free hit. And it will present itself for Raman Ulugodbaz again. The previous one he got from Shaheen Shah Afridi managed just a single. Baba Razam's having a little squiz here. Just remember the line belongs to the umpire. And he is over. one has to be impressed with the umpiring standard. The last game we saw the umpires making the right decisions all the times almost. I'm 
once and I got away with it again. He cleared his legs so far that he was all playing a different game. It was a no ball. It wasn't free yet, so you can understand the clearing of the left leg, but it does clear it a long, long way. Yeah, Ibrahim's a dry, just saying to him, you don't always have to look over mid-wicket. Down the ground might not be a bad option. That's nicely bowled. That's a better channel for Nassim Shah up front. End of the 